Hello and welcome to Indus News live from Islamabad. I am Muneeb Hamid with the headlines of this hour. U.S. President Donald Trump says he will reimpose international sanctions against Iran at the U.N. next week. Talking to reporters, Trump said Washington will trigger the snapback mechanism as he dismissed Russia's calls to hold a summit to discuss the matter. This comes a day after the U.N. Security Council rejected Washington's bid to extend a U.N. arms embargo on Tehran. Globally, the novel coronavirus pandemic has taken over 770,000 lives and infected more than 21.4 million people. In the US, nearly 1,100 people have died due to COVID-19, while nearly 50,000 people tested positive for the virus in the past 24 hours. Meanwhile, Brazil has registered over 41,000 new cases and 709 deaths in a day. India has recorded 944 fatalities, taking the toll to nearly 50,000 with almost 2.6 million cases. In Pakistan, the death rate continues to decline as six people have died overnight, taking the tally to 6,168. Thousands of Israelis are calling for Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu's resignation over corruption allegations and his handling of the COVID-19 crisis. Protesters clashed with the police outside the residence of the embattled Prime Minister. Netanyahu's approval ratings have plunged to under 30% in the recent weeks due to graft allegations and a tumbling economy. Well, that's all for now. For the latest updates, you can follow us on social media at Indus.news. Take care.